What's up, YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug. And what you see here is my brand new Amazon Echo wall clock. It's raining out here, y'all. So my lighting is not that great. I guess I could turn on the light, but you can see it. This is what it looks like. This is like a hard plastic. This is the back of it, y'all. Four AA batteries, in fact. I got mine recharged right there, so I'm gonna use these. I'm not sure if it use if it can use rechargeable batteries, but that's what I'm using. One thing I love about this clock already is it sets itself. So you don't have to worry about daylight saving time. Only thing you'll have to worry about with this clock is changing the batteries. That's it. I can live with that. All right, so we are replacing that clock up there. So let's get to it. That's a shame. I done had a Dollar Tree battery in there. <laughs> That don't look bad. I like that. Huh. Wish today was a little bit sunnier. You could see it better. But it, I, it, it actually looks good. So let's go ahead and activate this thing. My bad. I forgot to show you guys that. I'm going to keep these batteries. I'm just not going to use it for the clock. It did come with four um, AA batteries. Cool. So you don't have to worry about that, but I want to use good batteries, so that'll be less time that I have to go up there to change them. <laughs> this is the little start guide, so let me thumb through it and see what we got to do. Okay, what's in box? Clock, batteries, dryer, oil, screw, and anchor. I didn't see that. I don't need it, but it does come with it. I must have skipped over it. I don't see it, but that I don't, I don't need it. All right, I had to take it back down because apparently I have to press down this button, hold it down, <clears throat> tell it, um, till it blinks orange right here, and then it'll be in pairing mode. So let me hold that down. Ah. Let's see if we can see it. There we go. So now it's in pairing mode. So for some of you all that don't know, this is my Amazon Echo Show. That's when you hear me set the timer in my videos. This is what I'm using. Um, the voice is coming out of that, and that's going to work in conjunction with this. So, this can work with any of your Amazon Echo, whether it be a Dot or whatever you got. It work with anyone. This is closest to the clock in my kitchen, so I'm going to use this one. Set up my Echo wall clock. Okay. Press and hold the pairing button on the back of your Echo wall clock for up to 10 seconds until the light on the clock's face pulse is orange. Pairing may take up to a minute and the light will turn blue once paired. You can also pair or unpair your clock in the Alexa app under the Bluetooth settings of your Echo device. Okay, so I'm going to do that again. I I did that. The wall clock is paired. It will take a few minutes to set your clock to the time of your Echo device. Once the time is set, you can hang your clock using the mounting hardware provided. When you're ready, try setting a timer or ask, what can Echo wall clock do? Cool. So, alrighty. We'll wait for it to set itself and I'll be back. Man, this thing went around the whole all the numbers one time already so hopefully it will stop now <laughs> wow there we go finally you might want to give yourself 10 minutes to get this <laughs> set up <laughs> now that process alone it literally took about like three four minutes i'm not even joking all right so now that it's all paired up let's let's do something um set timer for one minute one minute starting now oh that's cool i 
I bet when they remake this, you know, make a newer version, I bet because this you can't see this at night. I mean, you could see that like the timer, but as far as the numbers and stuff like that, you won't. They don't glow. <clears throat> I wish that they would have thought of that, but that's probably going to happen when they, um, you know, make the newer version because, you know, Amazon's going to make a newer version. You can bet that. But this this works for me. And this is, you know, I'm always setting timers. And guys, sometimes when I, a lot of times I set timers is because, um, you know, I'll go in my living room and my, or my dining room while it's, while something is cooking. I don't just stay in my kitchen. So that's why I set the timer so I know when to come back. Cool. Stop. Huh. I like that. That's pretty cool. All right, guys. I'll give you a better look at it. I just put it back up. I think this clock is pretty awesome. It's about thirty bucks, guys. I think it's about five dollars overpriced. Um, yeah, twenty-five bucks would have been fair, but it's okay. My light's bright. Okay. Set timer for one minute and five seconds. One minute and five seconds, starting now. So I want to show you, again, how it looks. So this is just for one minute. When it gets to the one minute mark, it does that, and it does a countdown. It just does that. And then, <clears throat> this, the clock does not make any noise. Okay, so that would be up to your other Echo device, whether it be a dot or a show or whatever. Um, and it doesn't make any noise, and it, it'll blink. It's going to blink when it gets down to zero, I think like maybe six blinks, and then it'll stop. Even if your, um, your other Echo devices continue chiming, it'll blink about like four or six seconds, but I'll show you just so you can see it. And then we'll conclude this video. But like I said, I like this clock. It matches my decor. Um, I was just looking for something a little more jazzier than what I had up there. This is not for everybody, but you guys see how much time I use my clock in my videos. So see, it'll do that for a couple of times. A couple flash a couple more times, and then it will just stop. See? So it's not gonna do it no more. But pretty much that's it, guys. That's all I got. Um, another reason why I got this is so when you know Ashton's eating his breakfast, he can see the time. Every other clock in here is digital, so I want to get him familiarized. I, although he is pretty much eighty percent, ninety percent familiarized with this style of clock, but I want to, you know, the when the long hand is in between the numbers, we want to get that in there, um, see, it, get him used to that and stuff like that. And also, like, when he's eating breakfast, we're getting ready for school, I can just say, you know, set timer for 7.30, because that's when we leave in the morning. And so, he doesn't have to look back at the uh, Echo Show. He could just look up at that to the left. So, that's all I got. Well, I hope this video helped you guys out or showed you something new. Hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. Same thing. Thanks for looking at my video, y'all. It's Cooking with Doug.